YouTube, what's up? It's your boy Crypto J coming at you guys with yet another J Talks Crypto. If you're new to my channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button as well as the bell notification. Do my best each and every day to give you guys the top picks in cryptocurrency. And guys, nothing has changed. Nothing has changed. Literally nothing. Guys, we called this pump completely. Coming in at rank number 209 today, Terra Luna Classic. Jumping up two ranks, guys, on CoinMarketCap. As you guys can see, our 24-hour volume up 54%. I definitely could see Terra Luna Classic being a top 10 cryptocurrency. I'm not going to lie. Um, just because of the amount of speculation behind it in this sideways market. Now, I'm not saying Terra Luna Classic is going to be long-term uh, top 10 cryptocurrency. That can happen. But I'm saying uh, in terms of market cap that this thing can definitely make a run for the top if uh, people keep buying it the way that they are. As you guys can see, 24-hour volume up 54%. We made a video actually earlier talking about the key resistance that we were uh, butting up against right here when we were creating this bull flag. Uh, literally, maybe four hours ago, I made a video saying that probably this is going to break out in the next two hours. Took a little nap, and sure enough, it broke out two hours later. And uh, I actually even said in my last video, too, that we could probably expect to see a 30% price increase. And here we are sitting at 25%. So that last video aged very well. <laughs> so if you're not yet plugged in the channel, definitely plug in because we've been calling this stuff, guys. Literally, Terra Luna Classics, a coin that we've been talking about since this thing's launch. So um, we knew that this was going to be a coin that would have a great interest, as you guys could see over 200 million dollars now in total market cap just increased you know just blowing into the market 200 million dollars that's a lot of money so uh that is a lot of people that are again long and shorting the market and this is big this is big for holders this is big for price i'm interested to see how high this goes um somebody did ask in my last video when should they be taking profit in a situation like this Guys, I can't give, you know, that kind of information because, again, I'm not a financial consultant. I can't tell you when to take profit in these projects. We just talk about charts on here. My goal is to just help you get better at understanding and reading this and kind of knowing why this happened, you know, because we cover a lot of these coins. But um, a lot of the times people, they, they just want to buy things that I talk about because we have an incredible uh, win rate on this channel, but I want you guys to actually learn why we talk about what we talk about um, and how we find these trends even in a bear market. This one was a very easy call. A lot of the guys made a lot of money on this trade. As you guys can see, even um, on Coin Market Cap, a lot of these guys sitting in profit today, and good on them because it's not easy buying a highly speculative asset and sitting on it and waiting for this thing to pump, but. The people that dollar cost average we talk about on this channel tend to be the ones that have the last laugh, right? People tend to laugh at uh, these speculative coins when they're down here, but then when the internet starts talking in their favor, well, then people kind of start changing their tone. Then they, you know, come back and they're upset. But again, guys, this is why we put at least a little bit of money in some of these highly speculative assets because. It's not a bad idea. I made again. We made a lot of money off of Shib. That was another coin too that a lot of people told me, "Oh, why are you investing in Shib?" Even before uh, it was a, even at a billion dollars, you know, we we invested in Shib at two thousand wallets. So even before it was at a billion market cap, you know, I was getting slack all the time. Oh, it's a rug pull. The devs already left the project. Da, da, da. And, you know, that thing shot up to like $40 billion market cap, made a lot of people a ton of money. And it's looking like Terra Luna Classic wants to be the next Shiba Inu. That's just the way it's looking. I'm watching this thing climb ranks and uh, trend all over Twitter. Uh, we're kind of seeing some of the steam run off from the dog coin meme season. So we'll see what happens. Maybe Terra Luna has what it takes to kick off this bull rally. Maybe Terra Luna is the chosen one. You know, we had Doge kick it off at one point. We had Shiv kick it off at one point. You know, maybe Terra Luna Classic has what it takes. Because, again, guys, this one is a little like any of the others just because of how many people are watching it on CoinMarketCap. I expect this thing to run. I expect this 24-hour volume to be very high over the next couple weeks, even if that is shorts. You know, even if that's uh, the price taking a hit because people are going short on it. Again, guys, 
You can make money whether you're long in the market or you're short in the market. A lot of people are trading right now on KuCoin because that is where Terra Luna just listed recently. That, in my opinion, is the reason for this big price increase. We're seeing a lot more volume. You know, KuCoin is a platform that has a ton of volume on platform. So, um, you know, that is why I think that we're increasing today. But uh, I do think that now that we're in price discovery mode that, you know, you have to be responsible and... Um, I would be locking in some profits, you know, sooner or later. Definitely always want to secure the bag. At least take out your initial, you know, it's not a bad time to start taking profit. I know people don't like to hear that and they, you know, will fud up the comment section. But guys, it's good to take profit. You know, we talk about these things when they're down here so that we don't feel bad taking profit up here. But if you don't take profit up here, you're going to feel bad when it comes correcting down, right? So just keep that in mind. Always use risk management, guys. We're not over leveraging into crazy trades, right? We're not, uh, you know, spending all of our bags into one thing. We're always diversifying. If you are looking to get a position in this, in my opinion, you might want to wait on this to cool off a little bit just because, again, we try not to buy the tops of the projects on this. And, you know, we are making new all-time highs for the first time in a long time. Well, really, from the first time since this coin has launched, this is, um, well, this contract at least has launched. This is the highest market cap that it's gotten. So, you know, this is not necessarily a good buy zone. It's not a good entry point. We would definitely want to wait for this thing to come back down. It will come back down. Don't worry. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, we will be watching that, too, and we will be looking to take out short positions when this thing does decide to correct. If you're brand new to the channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button and the like and I will catch you in the next video. Peace.